Tinubu deceived Nigerians about removal of fuel subsidy. Wale Edum says, Good day, my people. Welcome once again to the news channel, and this is the headlines for today. As we see that Wale Edun, the Nigerian's Minister of Finance, has admitted that the government is still paying for fuel subsidy. We call that as soon as President Bola Ahmed Tinubu gained entry into office, he immediately called for the removal of fuel subsidy. But now, what and that led to the price of fuel going over a 500% increase of fuel in fuel price. But now, the Minister of Finance, Wale Edu, has admitted that they are still paying for fuel. Let's listen to the news in full. Wale Edu, Nigeria's Minister of Finance, has admitted that the government is still paying for fuel subsidies. This is surprising because President Tinubu announced last year that the subsidy was removed. This announcement led to higher fuel prices for everyone. Despite Tinubu's promise, the government is now spending even more money on subsidy than before. In 2023, the government spent 3.6 trillion naira on subsidies. And in 2024, they are expected to spend 5.4 trillion naira on subsidies. These details were found in a report called the Accelerated Stabilization and Advancement Plan, ASAP, ASAP, which was presented to President Tinobu by Minister Edun on Tuesday. This situation is confusing and upsetting for many people. Tinobu had said that removing the subsidy will help save money for other important things like building roads and schools. But it turns out that the government is still spending a lot on subsidies, even more than in previous years. My people, this is the news for today. It is really surprising that the Tinubu administration is still paying for fuel subsidy when they had initially told us that they were removing the fuel subsidy, which led to the massive increase in the price of fuel. Imagine that before fuel was of a little bit over 100 naira, 160, 180, around that range. And now fuel has shot up to about 600 to 800 naira per liter. And now we are hearing that even last year when fuel price was still minimal, before, before Tinubu administration, the government has paid 3.6 trillion naira on subsidy and now this 2024 that we are expected that the gov that the subsidies have been removed we should most definitely in include a total removal of subsidy prices we are now and now in this 24 it is expected that they are going to spend 5.4 trillion naira on well subsidy. This is quite outrageous and very funny because beyond and quite confusing because when the prices of well went up, it was recorded that removing the subsidy will help to save money for other important things like building of roads and schools and even further further improving the schooling system in the country. But now it turns out that the government He's still spending a lot on fuel subsidies, even more than before. And that's the news for today. Don't forget to like this video, comment on that this video, and subscribe to this channel to get more news from this channel.